Hi, my name is Rowan from Magic Mobility. I'm going to show you how to change the batteries on our X8 model. The first thing we need to do is to raise the seat up to access the circuit board so we can undo the steering lock. Okay, so first thing we do is we unclip the circuit board cover, which has got Velcro on the front, and slide it off. We then follow the steering lock wire to the circuit board, and using the clip on the top, press it down and remove the plug. We then uh, drag the wires out from under the seat unit towards the power module at the rear, so it's free and can come off. The next step would be to cut the zip ties holding the main wiring loom to the power module. And then we'll undo the bolts holding the power module onto the chassis. This allows us to remove the power module and undo the other can lead from the power module and the seat unit. The next step we're going to do is undo the four bolts holding the seat unit onto the chassis, which are the bolts in the furthest corners, front and rear. And that's it, the seat is now ready to lift off, so I'll get a few helpers and that'll be the next step. Next we grab our flat blade screwdriver and we remove the little covers on the screws that hold our cowling, being careful not to uh, scratch the paint or the cover. There's one in each, there's one at the front and then one at each corner on the rear, so it's three in total. And then we take our Phillips and just undo the screws. Okay, now that we've got our cover off, we remove our battery cover, which is six there. And now we get access to our terminals. Now uh, with the terminals, always remove the negative first and put it back on last, that way we avoid any sparking or shorting out of the terminals. Okay, so uh, now we've got the covers off and the terminals disconnected, now we get our battery lifter tool and we just lift the batteries out. So before uh, fitting the new batteries, make sure you put the Velcro strip underneath to hold them in place more securely and then they're right to go in. Okay, now that we've got our batteries back in, we just need to put the terminals back on in the reverse order, making sure we do the positive first and the negative last. Okay, now we just refit our battery cover. And that's it, we're going to put the seat back on and reassemble in the reverse order. Okay, now our batteries are back in and the cover's on, we will refit our trout. lining up the three screw holes and replacing the screws we took out earlier. Okay, now we'll refit the three plastic caps and then we're good for our seat unit to go back onto the chair. So now that our seat's back on, we can put, refit the four bolts in each corner and we'll do that up nice and tight. Okay, so now that our seat unit's back on, we can now hook up the electronics. We'll get our CAN bus cable and plug it back into the power module. Now we can bolt the power module back on to the chair. Okay, and the other thing we need to remember to do is to plug the steering lock wiring back into the circuit board under the seat. 